Hello my dear friends and my dear students. Today we will do the subtraction of time. Yes, that is 4 minutes 35 seconds. We will subtract this from 12 minutes 18 seconds. You can see here minutes and seconds are mentioned. So we will make two columns, minutes and seconds. We will not make the R column because in the subtraction question we don't have hours. Okay, let's do. First, we will write the upside numbers from which we have to subtract the terms. The greatest, yes. So, that is from means we have to write first this later term upside. Okay, there are 12 minutes and 18 seconds. And from this we have to subtract 4 minutes 5 seconds. So, in this way, first you have to write your terms. Now, we will subtract these terms. Okay. In the seconds, you can see 35 are downside, but 18 are upside. We can't subtract 35 from 18. So, what we will do? We will borrow from the minutes. Yes. When we will borrow from the minutes, suppose I am taking here I am giving 11 and 1 I am taking minute to the seconds. Means I am taking here 1 minute. But do you know 1 minute is equal to 60 seconds. So when I will take 1 minute from this, from here, then when it will go to seconds, it will become automatically 60 because 1 minute have 60 seconds. So, we will add here not 1, we will add here 60 because these are the column of seconds. I think you got this concept. So, 18 plus 60 will be there. When we will add this term, that will become 780. Means, these seconds will become 78 seconds. Now, we will subtract 35 from 78. Very easy. 8 minus 5, that is 3. 7 minus 3, that is 4. So, 43 seconds we got. And in the minute, we already have uh, taken away 1 from there. So, 11 minutes are left. Now, we will subtract 4 from 11. So, what will be? 7, 11 minus 4. So, it is our answer. That's very much easy. What is our answer? 7 minutes 43 seconds. Yes, I think you got it. Thank you.